Guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix GTA 5 activation uh, required. So without further ado, let's get started. Uh, depending uh, where you got uh, GTA, uh, I got it on Steam, but super similar process on um, Epic Games or Rockstar Games. So I will show you uh, how you can basically fix that. First of all, on Steam, you just need to uh, go to library, right click on the game, properties, uh, install files, and then you should see a uh, the size of installation and here should be browse button so you need to press on that and then new window will pop up here and then you need to scroll down until you see gta 5 exe file so as you can see here uh, this one and then what you need to do here is to go to properties compatibility and um, select run this programming compatibility mode 4 and select when uh, windows 8 and if it's not uh, if you select windows 8 and if it's not working then uh, select windows 7 and then you need to press change settings for all users and then select again the same uh, here right apply the changes and run the game and the problem should be uh, fixed on epic games as well uh, super similar uh, process here or rockstar games what you need to do here is to just simply go to library uh, find the game press burger menu and then you need to press on manage and then you should see this little uh, open install location here and with the uh, nxc file you need to do the same and if it's if this doesn't work then you need to just go to search then go to services and then you need to uh, click on one of the tasks here and press g and then you need to find any task with gta 5 if there is uh, here or rockstar games and what you need to do here is to right click on it go to properties and then uh, make sure that uh, with all the tasks related to Rockstar Games or GTA, uh, server status is stopped, right? And after that, uh, the problem should be solved. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And if I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.